मैं गांव का लड़का हूं और ज़्यादातर मेरी लाइफ जो है वो सिंगल स्क्रीन थिएटर में फिल्में देखते हुए गुजरी है मैं वो इंसान हूं जो सलमान खान की एंट्री पे सीटियाँ मारता था जैसे ज़्यादातर ये कहा जाता है कि जो फिल्में हम देख रहे हैं जैसे कि अगर हम सलमान खान की फिल्में देख रहे हैं तो हम कनेक्ट होते हैं उससे एक कनेक्शन है जो हम तुरंत फील कर लेते हैं जो इस तरह की आर्ट फिल्में होती हैं उससे हम वो कनेक्शन फील नहीं कर पाते हैं तो एक चीज़ होती है ना जैसे अगर कोई बच्चा दवा नहीं खाता है तो माँ क्या करती है कि गुलाब जामुन में दवा डालती है और बच्चे को दे देती है बच्चा मिठाई समझ के खा लेता है दवा का भी काम हो जाता है माँ को भी दिक्कत नहीं होती है तो इस तरह की चीज़ें फिल्मों में भी की गई गुलजार ने अपने टाइम में जब गुलजार जब फिल्में बना रहे थे तो उस टाइम एक तरफ फिल्में बन रही थी मारधाड़ वाली सीटी बजने वाली फिल्में और गुलजार क्या कर रहे थे वो इजाज़त बना रहे थे मासूम बना रहे थे अंगूर बना रहे थे तो गुलजार ने क्या किया था कि उन्होंने ओपिनियन थोपा नहीं उन्होंने ऑडियंस का टेस्ट देखा उनका माहौल देखा और ये देखा कि किस चीज़ से इनको कनेक्ट किया जा सकता है जिस तरह की कोशिश गुलजार ने की थी कि हम सिनेमा के आत्मा को भी बचाए रखें और ऑडियंस के इंटरेस्ट को भी बनाए रखें तो एज अ फिल्म मेकर आप ऐसी कोई कोशिश करने का सोच रही हैं कि नहीं सोच रही हैं सो थैंक यू दैट्स अ वंडरफुल क्वेश्चन सरप्राइजिंगली आई अंडरस्टूड every single word of it uh, so thank you for putting your passion into that question so i think it's a very tricky field you know i understand what you're saying in terms of you know some some films like even i have watched that's taken me a few days to really dissect and understand and of course you give it to a you know a mass audience in a single screen they're probably not going to get that and i think we also have to understand this is a paper i read about taste in film and why people watch film in india there's a huge crowd of people who watch just so they can switch off they deserve that you know after a after a long day at work and after a long day of stress or whatever they're dealing with they come in and they see a few scenes happening in a foreign country which they may never go visit but now they know what it looks like you know in switzerland for example yeah so aspirations that is beautiful films like that is needed for people to just snap out and enjoy but at the same time films like um I think after you watch footprints I would love to know your thought on you know what you thought of the film because what we have done with our film and there's a lot of films in this space where you talk about something important that you need to talk about but it's like you said it's not it's not quoted in a way but it's got things that you really connect with like the love between a father and daughter and you know on subconsciously there are elements and characteristics of people that you become familiar with and you start rooting for the character you know when you make things so realistic i think sometimes you know the commercial films that some commercial films i'm saying like the films that you know made me think that uk is so posh and i'm going to have the best life i felt while it was wonderful to watch it set my expectations so wrong and and i don't think that's fair but if that film had a few other characters maybe you know this family is doing great fantastic they're going sports car fantastic but if maybe they looked into the lives of um, a friend who is a normal worker and his or her lifestyle that would be responsibility from a filmmaker so we know this is what we're setting up for the film doesn't need to be on that but a little understanding a little representation is so important and i understand sometimes it's nice to see the fancier things in life but when you start believing it and you know the same thing happens when you have all these big mass films if you only make films that the audience like of course you're going to make money and producers are going to be happy but sometimes i think our audiences are so smart they like to be challenged also there is a scope like you know while filmmakers are going around the world watching films from around the world learning and And giving it to their audience. If filmmakers like us don't do that, it's unfair on audiences to keep them away from whatever is working for them. And I'm sure as audience, you'd want that growth as a spectator too. So I had a very interesting conversation with um, you know uh, Rahul this morning, and I said. What Jag festivals like you know uh, Jagran has done and other festivals have done is. in a you know you you put a film uh, i'm not talking about footprints a very artsy movie on screen and when you're watching it as part of a festival your guards come down you watch it in an intellectual way you watch it you come out and you discuss like you are 
everything about you know film and mise en scene but you put it in a single screen theater you go in as a normal film you come out and if you discuss intellectually they'll think what are you talking about do you see what i mean so when the attitude you have when it comes to film festivals if you can open that up a little bit to other commercial films too then maybe slowly it's like baby steps we take in a few years time i think we can have you know the ideal example where the film can entertain at the same time represent what's the reality in it too thank you